LK Comstock National Transit played a pivotal role in 2016 to expand the light rail system on two dynamic and growing metro areas in the United States. Project teams drew on their experience to meet demanding requirements in the construction of new LRT extensions on both Sound Transit in Seattle and Dart in Dallas. Sound Transit launched its new 1.9 billion University Link extension in March. U-Link runs underground from downtown Seattle, north approximately 3.6 miles through two new stations connecting the Capitol Hill District to the University of Washington. This addition also ushered in a new, smarter, fully integrated control system and wayside communication system for Sound Transit's entire network. LK Comstock and HSQ Technology teamed up to design, install, and test this new state-of-the-art system. The LK Comstock HSQ team managed the complicated conversion of the existing SCADA system into properly segregated and integrated subsystems for train control, emergency ventilation, and building management that now operate on two separate networks, the train control network and the fire life safety network. The project team extended these network configurations to the new U-Link line, bringing a consistent implementation and control system approach for the entire Sound Transit LRT system. South of Seattle, near SeaTac Airport, another LK Comstock team completed work on S-Link, also known as the South 200 Street Extension. Sound Transit launched this extension into revenue service in September. The 1.6 mile S-Link connects the current SeaTac Airport station and the newly built Angle Lake station. LK Comstock installed the overhead catenary, traction power, train control, and communication systems for the extension on an aerial guideway. HSQ worked as a subcontractor to assimilate the extension into the existing SCADA system and communication networks. In Dallas, LK Comstock served as a systems contractor for DART's Blue Line extension, a 2.76 mile double track southward extension featuring two new passenger stations taking the line to the University of North Texas at Dallas. LK Comstock furnished and installed two traction power substations and the corresponding DC feeder system the overhead cantonary system, the signal system, and a communication system with voice, data, and video communication. A compressed schedule and extreme summer heat presented challenges. Predecessor work delays caused LK Comstock crews to work up to 16 hours a day when temperatures averaged 97 degrees. LK Comstock completed the installation and testing on time without any lost time or recordable incidents, resulting in a successful revenue service startup in October. Both Sound Transit and DART have additional expansion plans on the horizon. And with more light rail, electrification, and streetcar opportunities ahead in the U.S. and Canada, an experienced LK Comstock team is ready for the challenge. On behalf of the Sound Transit and DART project teams, this is Bill Haven, Vice President of U.S. Operations for LK Comstock National Transit.